So if we go back to the home screen, we'll see that my exercise library is completely and totally empty. And I wanted to showcase this on purpose for a reason. So we'll go back to programs, we'll edit this program, and I wanna show you guys how easy it is to create exercises. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to put together a regular day of training and it's, I'm gonna to put together some random stuff so don't judge me on the exercises that are chosen or the sets and reps because this is not a program that I assigned for somebody, this is just a test of the programming capabilities. So I'm gonna write out things like a squat, Let's make them do three sets of six with a three zero zero tempo. And we're gonna make them do it with 200 pounds, should be around RPE eight. Cool, add an exercise. Let's do some bench press. And let's have you do two sets of 15 with a three one zero one tempo. And let's have this one say it's gonna be with 135 pounds. This should be about an RPE nine. Now, I wanna add in some accessories, but I wanna do a little superset because this person is doing squats and push. So I'm gonna put in some goblet squats here. And let's say they're gonna do four sets of 12 here with no tempo, and I want them to work up to an RPE nine. Across all four sets. I'm gonna add another exercise here. We're gonna add some incline dumbbell press. We'll have them do the same thing, four sets of 12, adding up to an RPE nine. Now, what I can do here is I can drag this note down. So I can do that for anything that's on here. If I wanted to just fill this out, I can drag it down very easily. I'm then gonna hit these, and I'm going to hit this little button down here to superset the two. Now, if I wanna see it from the athlete side, all I would do is click into here, and if I would hit this little dumbbell, it'll get me started. It'll take me to this, so let's say everything was perfect. I hit start training, and look, everything is auto-populated immediately. So all of these are automatically filled, supersets are denoted and linked together, and then there's a clear break between the next exercise. Everything is put together the way that we want it to be. Now, one of the cool things about this, right, if we go training complete, we're gonna return to the program. If I go back home, right, I go to my exercise library, and remember all those exercises that I was putting in that were not in the library? They are all there now. And if I wanted to edit them, all I have to do is hit this. I can tag whatever I want to tag it as. I can add a video whenever I want to add a video. I can even do the same thing and do a bulk tag a bulk tag by just clicking this little drop down arrow here. Or just hitting here and just tagging them whatever I want it to. If I don't like any of the exercises or if there's duplicates, I can literally just hit this button, delete selected exercises, and they are all going to be gone and then they will still remain in the training program. This is a service that only exists through the Compound app and we are extremely excited to bring it to you guys. Click the link in the bio, make sure you follow the at get, uh, get Compound app page and check it out. We have a waitlist coming soon. App is gonna release on March 14th. Later everybody.